The massive plume ash has disrupted air traffic across Europe and shows little sign of letting up. One expert said the eruption of the volcano about 120 kilometers southeast of the capital could abate in the coming days, but a government spokesman said ash would keep drifting into the skies of Europe. The thick dark brown ash cloud that shot several kilometers into the air and has drifted away from the North Atlantic Island has shut down air traffic across Northern Europe and restrictions remain in place in many areas. Norway and Sweden said they would resume limited flights in their northern areas, but the Netherlands, Poland and the Czech Republic joined the list of countries with closed airports. In Iceland, air traffic has operated at a minimum with 71 planes on Thursday, compared to 300 daily flights on a regular basis. Scholars at the University of Iceland say the volcano is still erupting and producing gas on the same level as on Thursday. They expect it to continue for two more days, but say there are limits to the amount of magma that can spew out, adding that it cannot continue at the same rate for many more days. It is the magma or molten rock beneath the Earth's surface coming out of the volcano that has turned into ash. The eruption has taken place near a popular hiking ground in southern Iceland. The volcano under Iceland's fifth largest glacier has erupted five times since Iceland was settled in the 9th century. Iceland sits on a volcanic hotspot in the mid-Atlantic ridge and has relatively frequent eruptions, although most occur in sparsely populated areas and pose little danger to people or property. Before March, the last eruption took place in 2004.